I hope you were listening to Nancy Pelosi this week. Um, she brought up something, and, and you know, I got to be honest, when she said this, I remember hearing the same thing when I was a little kid oh, yeah. about if you kept digging a hole in your backyard, you'd eventually get to China. I, I tried. I never, I never got so much as a wonton, okay? <laughs> I just never got that far. But she brings it up, and, and I, it's kind of a funny statement. Let's watch. When I was a little girl, I was told at the beach if I dug a hole deep enough, we would reach China. So we've always felt a con connection there. I, I was just thinking, Nancy, since you've been in the house, you've been digging a hole. I mean, a really big hole. And it's like you're digging to try to get to China and uh, maybe help you and all the folks on your loony left um, be able to have a fast track to dump more money to them. Who knows? Maybe that's what this is all about. You heard that when you were a little kid? Oh, yeah, absolutely. And at the beach. And I remember trying. Yeah. You know, maybe if they start digging on the other side, we can meet in the middle. When I was a kid, I never got to go to the <laughs> beach. I never thought I would see salt water as a kid. But um, just digging in my backyard, I thought I could get from Hope, Arkansas to uh, somewhere. Maybe all the way to Shanghai. Who knew? <laughs> I never got there. Um, this is one for the books. I'm not sure what she was trying to get across. Uh, obviously, the Chinese were very upset that Nancy Pelosi went to Taiwan, and they pushed back hard. So she's trying to do some damage control. Kind of blew up in her face like an exploding cigar. Let's watch. We still support the one China policy. We go there to acknowledge the status quo is what our policy is. There was nothing disruptive about that. It was only about saying China is one of the freest societies in the world. Don't take it from me. That's from Freedom House. Uh, don't take it from her because she was about as wrong as she could get. Now, if she's speaking of Taiwan, Taiwan is one of the freest countries on earth. But China, mainland China, the so-called People's Republic of China, is one of the least free places. Nine points out of 100. It's not a very good grade, is it? Mm -hmm. So yeah, Taiwan, very free. Got a lot of freedom there. It's called the Republic of China. But the People's Republic of China, which is Communist China, it ain't so free. I've been to both places. I'm going to tell you something. There's a huge difference in the freedom between mm -hmm. the two countries.